Hey guys, so I was tagged by Stay Beautiful XO, the lovely Brittany. She's one of my YouTube girls. Um, she tagged me to do the Fall Obsessions tag. And I was so happy that she tagged me so I could do this tag because I think that this is the perfect video to go into transition for the fall. Um, it was the first day of fall a couple days ago, so by the time you guys see this, it'd probably be a week into fall. But I'm going to go ahead and get started. There are a couple categories, um, and a lot of these products I've mentioned before, so I'm sorry but these are just like my favorite fall obsessions and things that I'm going to be using to transition into the fall. So my favorite face product is um, a moisturizer. It's Clinique Use Surge SPF 15 and I absolutely love this moisturizer. That's what it looks like. Um, I've done a review on this. I've mentioned this in so many videos. This, okay, so I was looking for a perfect moisturizer and this moisturizer was the one that I found that was the best for my skin um, when transitioning into the seasons and stuff so this is a little bit more of an expensive product but it works really well and it's really good money to invest to well invest in I mean the next is a favorite blush and mine is a blush combo duo and it's the Smashbox Big Cheek Duo on the Town and that's what it looks like. I've hit pan, so it's kind of just, it's almost done. And I've, ugh, I've been trying to keep this and try not to use all of it, but it's so hard because I love the way it looks on my skin now because I'm kind of tan, kind of not. So it's kind of like perfect for me at this time. And it's almost done. I actually got this in Sephora when it was five dollars in the, like the beauty of the beauty of the beauty of the day. If you walk into the store, um, they have a little bin full of stuff, and you can pick things from the bin, and it's five dollars. So, um, that's how I got this, and I was really excited. And these are normally like twenty eight dollars. So if they have something similar to this, I would definitely get it. This is like the best. Um, the next one is favorite lip combo, which is what I have on my lips right now. It's the NYC in Mocha. It's really, really brown, but when you put it on, it's not too dark. And these are like 99 cents. I don't know. I've just been loving the consistency. This has been with my MAC Underage Lip Gloss. This is what it looks like. So these two combined kind of gives you that light slash dark look like in in between without being too too dark or too too light so it's kind of like transitioning into the fall that's my favorite lip combo uh, my favorite eye product I didn't want to pick like anything like eyeshadow wise or anything like that I wanted to pick something that I always use to get rid of my circles and that's the Clinique all about eyes rich and that's what it looks like I can't tell you how many times I've talked about this product. This is like the best product ever. So um, I love this and I'm sorry, but my throat feels really dry and that's why I like, I feel like, I don't know, it's just weird. So I keep swallowing and it's probably really annoying, but I'm sorry. And that's that. The next one is favorite nail polish. Okay. This nail polish is one of my favorites. Once the fall comes in, like, it's like transition into fall, you can start doing the dark colors on your fingers. This is what I'm going to be doing. I haven't painted my nails yet. I'm going to go ahead and paint them tonight. I probably will do this color because I haven't done this since, like, last fall. So this one is China Glaze in Ingrid. That's what it looks like. I absolutely love this color. This is, like, the all-time favorite color that I have. And then the next one is favorite hair product. Now, I couldn't have survived the summer without this hair product. This product is, it's a 10 miracle, um, miracle even product. And it does 10 things and it does everything it says. It's just the best. And I was able to kind of get my hair a little bit longer and grow it out. And this has really helped it um, do everything that it says in the back. And then the last one is favorite fashion item. Now, mine is the leather jacket. Now, I know um, leather jackets were in last year too. And this is when I got my leather jacket. This one's from Kohl's. I paid like $24 for it, which isn't bad for a leather jacket. Well, it's not leather. It's like pleather. But it's amazing. And I absolutely love this. I will start wearing this as soon as it gets a little bit colder. And that's what it looks like on the sides. And that's what it looks like in the back. I absolutely love this. This is a, a really funny story quick. My sister was packing for college and she's like, oh, 
I really wish I can take something of yours, but I know you're not going to want to, but you really don't wear it all the time. And I was like, what is it? And she's like, your leather jacket. I'm like, okay. So I came with, like, we agreed that I will let her borrow my leather jacket and take it all the way down to Philly. And um, she can bring it up the next time she comes back. So when she comes in on October 1st, I'm going to go ahead and give her, um, give her this jacket. And then when I see her on the 22nd of October, I will get it back. So that's our little trade thing. She really loves this one. She hasn't been able to find like one that she really likes yet. So as a good sister, I'm letting her borrow it. Another favorite fashion of mine, I forgot because I'm wearing them, are these um, earrings from Forever 21. I love these. They're feathers with little beads. They are my favorite. So that's all. I'm going to go ahead and tag the people that I want to tag down below. And I guess that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.